guys, thank you so much for choosing my channel to click on today. I am so glad you're here, and today we are going to get into some Lay Lay Posh. All right, so we have the 1980s palette that just came out. We also have the lippy. I think I'm going to try to pair that up today. We'll see if it looks good. And then the loose glitter in Hit the Slopes. This was her December glam bag. It was 80s themed. Cannot wait to dip into this. Okay, so this is what this palette looks like on the inside. We have Os um, Icy Snowsuit, which would be this one over here. We have Moon Boots right here. We have Moon Boots, and then right under Moon Boots is Duh and Heather. So we are going to um, prime my eyes and get into this. I'm so excited. This was this was a very exciting uh, glam bag this month. I was really, really, really looking forward to this. And I knew that the colors were going to be perfect. Everything was going to be perfect for this one. Lele Pasha's glam bags are once a month. She's not going to be doing one next month because she's going to do her mystery boxes and three different tiers and so your largest tier of the mystery boxes are going to be a hundred dollars and then the next one down from that is $75 and then the smallest one is $30 and there's something that I really love about these mystery boxes is because everything that comes in the $30 box is everything that comes in the $30 box. Everything that comes in the $75 box is everything that's in the $30 box plus more items and then if you get the $100 box you get everything that's in the $30 box, everything that's in the $75 box plus more items. So that's so exciting to me. And it is released on my birthday, December 30th. And so, hey, I guess I know what I'm getting for my birthday this year. Um, yes, that is it. <laughs> these are glam bags, though. And these come once a month, except for next month since the mystery boxes. And these run $30. And that includes shipping. So gives you you get such a different variety of different things each month and it's always sw switched up this has a palette in it which i think is really awesome okay so um i am going to go in with heather and i'm going to take that and we're going to take that right on up in here this i know like these colors oh my goodness goodness gracious i'm loving this matte formula that she has in here. I swatched it. This is my first time actually playing with it. So far so good. I'm going in very light because there's there's no kickback. There's no kickback when I put my brush in it. All the pigment is going right on the brush. I'm building it up slowly though because I want to use this more for my transition. I'm going to deepen it up with the other colors. So I don't want to go too dark with this look. I want to keep it 80s themed. You know what I mean? I thought with my blue and purple hair, some pink ears would be screaming some 80s. Love the names that she chose for these and everything. So much fun. And I think her husband helped her with this one, though, actually. So I don't know if she named them or her husband named them, but then there's um, Duh, which is a dark chocolate purplish brown. It's got some sparkle in it too. I wouldn't say too much purple, but like it kind of picks up kind of a little bit of a purple tone, but a good color to deepen up a purple look. I'm going to take some more pink and build that back up in there. I don't want to take it too much. I'm going to take a clean brush. Going in with the JP007 Pro Blending Brush from Juvia's Place. I really do like these brushes. Just trying to keep it nice and blown out, but not muddy. Like mixing those two, I need them to 
and well. Just keep the color, you know. Blend, but keep the color. Okay, so trust the process, just keep pushing. Okay, now I'm gonna go into Moon Boots with my finger. Get that color, oh my goodness. So pretty, so pretty. Look at the mirror, it even has a mirror in this palette. Love that. I have a feeling she kind of gave this one away. Don't think she made much profit off of this little collection. I'm gonna blend it more later, but and then I'm gonna go in with I see a snow suit. I'm gonna put that on in the inner part. But we're not done yet. Just wanna layer that on there. This icy snowsuit just feels like velvet. It's very soft. It's very not silky feeling necessarily, but like like touching a like a, a blanket, you know, like a soft, cozy blanket, you know. It's very soft. Which to me think I would think that that might be a new formula. I don't know. I could be wrong, but I don't think I have felt this formula in her shadows before. I know she's playing around for this next year. Okay. There's that. And then we're not done. I think I'm going to just take it up a little bit, a little notch, a little notcheroo. I'm going to do a hydro liner. And before I do the glitter, I'm going to do, I'm taking hydro liner in my Nina. <laughs> I never really noticed what the name of the company was until I got it in the mail. And I was like, mm, my Nina. <laughs> so how suiting is that to do a hydro liner with Lele Posh and do my Nina? I'm just going to take and carve it out a little bit. All right, there's my purple liner. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some of this um, ABH glitter glue and I am going to put glitter right over top of um, snowsuit. So I'm gonna take that, hit the slopes. Okay, yes, that is what I was looking for. Okay, so I got most of the eye look done. I'm going to um, wipe off my face, do the rest of my makeup. We'll come back and talk about what else I put on my um, on this look. So I will. So we'll talk about what all else I use off camera, and I'll come back and I'll see you in a few. Okay, guys, this is my final look. I am loving this little bundle. I love it. I love it. I love it. Like, I just must be an 80s girl through and through. Even though I, most of the time I grew up in the 90s as far as my teenage days go. But I must just, I just must exude 80s. I don't know. I love these colors. I just love it. Love it, love it, love it. I love the glitter. The glitter is something else. Yes. And I'm glad that I did the um, hydro liner 
kind of just kind of cuts that, separates the two regular look. I do notice that I did not put any inner corner. So we're going to do that right now. So I want to do Party Monster from um, Urban Decay Glitter. Put that in my inner corner. I think that will be, that'll just set this look off. So let's do this. We're going to go into Party Monster. It's going to be so pretty. I love this inner corner. It's like a neon purplish blue. Okay. Yes, that is what I was looking for. I needed my inner corner. Okay, so let's go over a little bit. This was, again, Party Monster with Urban Decay. I use the Anastasia Beverly, here, Beverly Hills Glitter Adhesive for the glitter. Um, I just didn't tell you that earlier. Of course, I used the, so this is the lippy out of the um, 80s Baby Bundle that I used on my lips. And then um, I have Ardell lashes on in 160 Black, the natural hair ones. I also used Alamar um, Blush Palette. I actually used these two shades in my blush that I mixed together on my lashes before I put on the false lashes. I use the Mana um, Turn It Up Beauty Mascara. I used the Cihate Fierce Flix Eyeliner, and that's just right in the corner there. Um, I also used, for my foundation, I used the El Maquillage. Um, I'm in shade 40, Woke Up Like This. And for my... Um, my base underneath it, I use the Bobbi Brown face base only until I get my Lele Posh face base. Um, and I use for setting spray, I use my Dewy Set, and I'm almost out, but this is my favorite Dewy Set setting spray. So I love this look, you guys. I hope you guys like this. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you guys haven't tried Lele Posh, glam bags are your best friend. They come monthly unless she has some kind of special going on. You can get these glam bags for $30. It includes shipping and you get a ton of product for that price. So, um, and there's usually always a theme and it's just, it's so much fun. So what do you guys think? Tell me down below. I'm really digging it. I'm loving this look. So I hope you guys enjoy this and I hope that you guys all have a blessed day. Take care. Bye-bye. Getting my heart.